Lithuania do come away with it. And Alan Campbell gets his body in the way, something he does so well for Motherwell. One of these players always feeling that sort of John McGinn type mould that uses their body so well as Glenn Middleton does fantastically well on that left hand side to squeeze in between a couple of Lithuania defenders, but his shot is deflected. That was fantastic play there from Alan Campbell. As you said, great physical strength to Glenn Middleton and nice wee twist and turn. But Wasn't quite to be for him here as he lines up to take the corner. And well, arriving at pace was George Johnson, but he was unable to get his head on it. But there is another chance for Scotland. Billy Gilmore just passing it out to Alan Campbell, who skips by a couple of men, and it's a good ball to Glenn Middleton. Tries to get it into that six-yard box, but it's crowded in there just moments after the corner. Scotland seeing a lot of the ball at the moment in good areas, and it's a good header down by Porteous, and it drops to Fraser Hornby. And that, I think you can see, is Scotland's first real chance of the game, dropping to Fraser Hornby, not far away from the six-yard box. It was maybe just too tight to his body as it dropped down to him. Couldn't quite sort his feet out in time as it was flicked on by Ryan Porteous and the goalkeeper Kratokas came rushing out and stopped it well. It was a great opportunity. Um, I don't think he'll be as frustrated with that because he knows that there'll be more chances that'll come. Gilmore. Well, that's a great ball in and oh, that's a good double save. It looked as if from Kratokas. He had to get in there because the header was certainly going on target. We see that again. He put his right hand up first of all, tipped it up the way, just got the contact away from it and Billy Gilmore curls one in good shape on it as it falls to Fraser Hornby who holds his man off well it's now Kyle Magenis who spreads it out to George Johnson and it's clipped back in a great delivery by George Johnson and it's fallen into the back post for Glenn Middleton whose right footed strike goes over the bar a real chance there for Scotland yeah he's looking a wee bit frustrated there very good opportunity yeah always hard when the ball comes to you and it's bouncing up the way. Left footed in towards Fraser Hornby who takes it down well and it's Alan Campbell with a chance here. But it goes straight to Kratokas. As the ball is flicked in, it's got good shape on it towards that back post but it's well defended by Daniel Harvey. Just got his body in the right position and made sure that Cloney Eunice couldn't get his foot in at the back post. He was going for it as well. McCrory. That's flicked on towards Fraser Hornby, who goes down. And it's going to be a free kick to Scotland. Fraser Hornby thinks that one was in the box, but the referee says no. Jakovic, he runs over. We have a look at this one again. It was flicked on well by Lewis Ferguson. Oh, just, and that just. is a good decision by the referee just outside the box. As Glenn Middleton lines this one up, and it's a good strike by Glenn Middleton. But it's palmed away by... Kratikas or will it be Middleton or will it be Fraser Hornby Hornby to take and that one's flashed just wide of the Lithuania goal trying to get that one round the wall and into the bottom corner Fraser Hornby well, looked very focused in his run up there Fraser Hornby the goalkeeper never looked too troubled Great ball out by George Johnson there to find Daniel Harvey, who hasn't really had the chance to get in dangerous areas so far. He crosses that one in. Hornby takes it down well, and a strike from distance from Billy Gilmore. And he certainly caught that one well, and he had the goalkeeper scrambling, just unable to get that one on target. Plays the ball into the middle of the park. It's back out here, Sisplaukas. And they've got a chance here. Two men on this right-hand side. Jankowskis plays it inside. And it opened up for the number nine there. It's going to be another strike from Glenn Middleton. And this time he's unable to hit the target. That one over the bar. And more and more. You can see the frustration from Glenn Middleton there. It certainly wasn't it there. Good work with bodies around him. And the ball spread very well by Stephen Kelly. Out to that right-hand side, Glenn Middleton now with another chance to try and run at these Lithuania defenders. And he does brilliantly to get past his man. Glenn Middleton cuts it back to the edge of the box and Stephen Kelly's there. And it's well saved by Kratikas. 
Stephen Kelly, we talked about the goal threat he has from that midfield. Four goals for Air United so far this season on loan from Rangers. And with Glenn Middleton doing some great work down that right-hand side and cutting the ball back to him. Maybe just not the cleanest of strikes. Not enough power on it.